Hey, we're here. Hey. Hello. Hi, Trey. Hey. Hey, Emily. How are you? I'm doing really well. How are you? I'm good. I'm really excited to dive into this new Honey Killer box because it had blood all over it, and that's pretty cool. I mean, not yeah, cool for you because was... you had to deal with red blood, but. Look cool. It was weird. There was like two <laughs> little things that were stuck together with this big glob of like bright red fake tacky blood. <laughs> and I had to put it in the freezer and take them apart. But I got them apart and I'm very excited. And there's just little blood spatters all over the envelopes too, which I thought was charming and adorable. <laughs> the I'm blood was charming person, and I adorable. I like it. I like I like I like that. That's nice. <laughs> I love charming and adorable blood. <laughs> Sorry, one more time. Your your audio is cutting out. What's that? I love charming and adorable blood. Yeah, it's so cute. So this is box four of season three of Haunted Killer. Um, and this is our first episode with this box. So I think we're just going to kind of tear in and see what we got. All right. All right. What's up first? Uh, This postmark. We for some reason we started yeah. saving all the postmarks. I don't quite remember why. I think I don't know. I think there's a method behind it, but we really do have them for every every single box. Uh, Are they different? Then, Can we look at that real quick? Uh, sure. So here's the one we just got. Uh, okay. Here's the one for box three. Main nine one seven and seven oh nine oh seven nine. Okay, it's probably the same then. Yeah, and then we have. Uh, this is box four. This one's different. This oh, one's from different? Montana. Okay. Uh, that's box two, sorry. Uh, and then another box two is also Montana. Hmm. So after the first two, they switched to Maine. I guess that's hmm. worth noting. Well, yeah. wait a minute. Oh, no, there's like the inside and the outside one. The, there's like the... Yeah, they're from different places. Okay, I see what's happening. Yeah, so we don't, we don't have both of them every time. We only have... Apparently, we only oh. have the outside one for the first two. Oops. Well, I save all the envelopes because, again, I'm that kind of person. So, hey, whatever. I can go back and look. <laughs> whatever. It works. Um, yeah, and we've built a beautiful little archive here in the like, scrolly sidebar. Um, it's quite lovely. So, yeah, then we have our package ID from, from Meg signed off. And then you sent me this photo of what I assume is blood spattered on the envelope. Yep. I'm really surprised yep. that didn't get the attention of the post office. <laughs> <laughs> well, it comes. It all comes in a box too. So oh, like, okay, okay, okay. All yeah. Right. Um, yeah. So envelope blood funny, spattered though. all over it. <laughs> uh, and then traditionally, I believe we start with the letter from Felix. Yeah. Yeah. All right. You want you want to read this one? Or you want me to read this one? Uh, I can take this one. All right, it go. says, "Listening go friend, the sheriff will be gone by the time you read this. It's his prerogative, of course. He can ride off into whichever sunset he so chooses." Too bad he never saw past the plywood facades leading the dusty dirt, lining the dusty dirt road. Uh, but though his comprehension of our arrangement was limited to what I allowed him to know, he was my agent on the ground in Bozeman. It's up to you now. Pay close attention. The devil is always in the details, as they say. Mm, don't know how to pronounce that Latin phrase. Felix. Uh, Teso, Teseo. Teseo Lumanani? Lumani? Humani. No, I think that's an H. Humani. Yeah, I think you're right. Humani. Let's Google it. Humani. Yeah, go for Let's it. Let's Google it. Teseo Humani. Why did... This is a very strange <laughs> change in tone for Felix, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. This is a very strange ah. change in tone for Felix. I don't know how I feel about this. What's it mean? Ugh, I don't know. Hold on a second. Let me try. Just say, oh. Yeah, I just Googled it and it gave me like a whole bunch of ridiculousness. So I'm going to go to Google Translate directly. Just say, oh, Humani translation. I say nothing of the human. What the hell does that mean, Felix? 
Uh, what? I don't know. All right. Uh, All right. Felix is a weird guy. So Felix just got ten times weirder on my like. I kind of I kind of felt like Felix Felix prior to this was kind of hapless and witless, and now I yeah now he's troubling. Yeah. Huh. So also in the envelope with Felix's letter, the next one is oh, the, the, the this Gallatin county sheriff's office. The oh yeah 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 because the sheriff's letter comes with Felix's letter or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, where the where the, where the what 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 did the list come with? That was in in the envelope with everything else. Huh. The first envelope was just Felix and the sheriff, and then everything else was in the second. Okay, well then let's get the sheriff up here and read the sheriff's letter. All right, I'll be the sheriff this time. Ooh, do the accent again. That's oh, my favorite part. Oh, the sheriff accent. I forgot. It's from Sheriff Randall Dieter. Dear Felix, maybe my last letter didn't make the situation clear to you. I can only assume that if it had, you would have gone back to me by now. But since I haven't heard from you, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. And this time I'll say in no uncertain terms, sir, we have a problem. In case you don't recall, I've got a dead body decomposing out in the woods in worse shape than just about anything I've ever seen, and I've been sitting on this information for weeks now because when we first spoke, you impressed upon me the importance of discretion. Well, I'm all for treading lightly where it counts, but prudent isn't the same as looking the other way. It doesn't sit with right with me, this hanging back, ignoring the problem, not least if all it's a matter of time before someone else finds the body. And by then, your discretion won't do either of us a lick of good. I'm, I might as well go ahead and warn you. I'm not going to sit back and wait for you any longer. I've thought about this long and hard, and I'll see what I have to do now. That schedule you sent was what clinched it for me. I should have realized right away, but it seems clear as day now. Last time I was out at the facility... Dr. Cortez told me that Meg Gibson has just stepped out for her break, but the calendar said she was supposed to be off that day. And another thing, the groundskeeper got back from vacation more than a week earlier, and why did all the hedges look so ragged and unkempt? Part of me wouldn't be surprised if that was his body I stumbled across out in the woods. Either either way, it doesn't add up, and I'm certain now that your Dr. Cortez is hiding something, or, or worse. I don't know if you care to hear it, but consider this your notice. I'm going back back out there to get some answers from the good doctor, and I'm not going easy on him. I've let the grass grow under my feet, but I'm surely not going to make the same mistake twice. Sincerely, Randall J. Dietrich, Sheriff, Gallon County Sheriff's Office. Um, multiple notes from this. One. Yeah. <laughs> No one said yeah. Meg was on a break. They said she was off. We read that multiple times, right? Mm-hmm. Two. Did you think Dr. Cortez was a woman? Yes. I did too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, because I, it's like, I think it's in the first box. It mentions her first name and it is Willa, not Will. So like... I think we went on that assumption for the first two boxes. And then last box, somebody said something about that Will's a good one or something. Yeah. Yep. 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 So, yeah. Yep. Basically is what that boils down to. What the, what the crap? I don't know, man. <sighs> okay. So uh, that's okay. a lot to digest. All right, we'll come back to this. It is, huh? And so tying that back to Felix's letter, the sheriff works for Felix in some capacity. I guess says Felix. I mean, we don't really know that. Yeah, that's true. How though, I, man? I know. I don't know. Hmm. All right. Here's Meg. You want to take Meg? Yeah, yeah. So Meg says, Dear listening friend, I have been having a lot of fun seeing the correspondence between you and Jasper. He's funnier than I first thought. I don't really think Jasper's that funny. Oh, whatever. I also don't uh, find Jasper You that should funny. know... 
<laughs> he's real creepy. Yeah. You should know that he's everything is going funny. well here. There was a there was a schedule hiccup, but everything is fine now. It was more trouble than it should have been to make all that time up. I'm looking forward to my trip. I've been planning it for a long time now. There are so many beautiful things to see and photograph. Everything is very positive. Thanks for listening, Meg Gibson, Inspector LFOA. Why is she talking about I'm the curious, schedule hiccup? Yeah, I'm curious as to why she needs to mention that they have scheduling issues to this like person that has nothing to do with the staff at LFOA. <laughs> Like, I feel like maybe you're overcompensating just a little bit. Just a little bit. And then there was this random list of stuff, which I don't really know what to make of at the moment. Oh, the, the travel to-do list? Yeah. Yeah, I don't... I don't have any clue. We'll just kind of move that down here. Yeah. Uh, you want to do Felix or Sylvia first? Or, uh, I'm sorry, uh... Jasper or Sylvia first? Let's do Sylvia. Okay. Uh, this is going to have to be a team effort, I think. So this letter, sure. uh, uh, at first glance, this is the first time I've really looked at it. This appears to have been shredded and pieced back together. Mm-hmm. And also burned. Or something. Or maybe this is actually mm -hmm. mold. This might be mold. Gross. Yeah, maybe. And there is also... A whole bunch of weirdness. At the top and bottom, yeah, it like kind of flows together if you switch back and forth. Uh, but I think we should discover that in just a minute. We should get through this letter first. Huh. All right, all right, all right, all right. So uh, let's start with just the 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 basics of this letter. Uh, you you want to you want to go here? Yeah, sure. Uh, Sylvia says, Dear Jasper, how are you holding up? You know, lately I've been thinking a lot about you and your situation. It still doesn't seem right. You don't belong in that place. There has to be a good reason for what you did. Uh, there's something I'm missing in all this, something that will explain everything away, I'm sure of it. Normally I would never try to justify such a thing, but it's different because it's you. I know you, don't I? The more I kept thinking about you the more restless i felt and the more i wanted to see you. you drove or i drove out to the facility hoping we might get the chance to speak i didn't expect it to be so far from town or for the building to look so old from what i could see the grounds were well kept but the rest of the place was pretty run down when is this from even i mean it's clearly old yeah uh of course they wouldn't let me pass the gates i had a feeling they wouldn't but I thought I'd be able to talk to someone at least and explain my reason for being there. Have the we already heard this story from her once? I feel like we have, yeah. Okay, sorry. Eventually one of the, no, it's fine. Eventually one of the staff members approached me, Dr. Cortez. She. What the fuck? Okay, All Was right. about to drive past the gates <laughs> and must have seen me hiding, idling in my car. She was nice enough and didn't seem irritated that I was there. She kindly let me know that there was no visiting hours. So that lines up. Uh, that struck me as disconcerting because even prisons allow visitors in most cases right i asked her about you and maybe that was a mistake but she said she wasn't at liberty to discuss her patients patients prisoners is there even a difference in that place i really don't have a firm grasp on what these listening friends facilities are meant for me either sister it H. feels more isolating than anything oh it's it okay never mind never mind what nothing 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 oh. Uh, you must miss being on the outside. Do you think about the shop often? Do you think about our work, about me? I hope so. I hope this isn't all for nothing. Take care, Sylvia. And then, so there's jazz at the top and the bottom. Uh, there's I will come exactly 2.30 in the morning. My... Next letter. Letter. I uh, will tell you one month from now. I will come two thirty in the morning. One, one month, month from, from now, now, my next letter will tell you where to go. Uh, well, that was easy to decipher. 
We didn't even have to try it that one. I kind of have a feeling maybe that's not it. <laughs> like no. that's not that's not all there is to it. I think that was pretty meant to be pretty easy. I'm gonna go ahead and write it down anyway. I was just gonna I ask you if you could jot that down. Come. I will come exactly two thirty in the morning. One month from now. My next letter will tell you where to go. Interesting. 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 Yeah, man. Yep. All right. Got that note. Oh, well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What? Oh, her letter already told him where to go. Wasn't there like something about a rec room or something? That's true. We have determined that these are out of order. Yeah. So what did and she do when she got she there? she did mention a rec room window. Yeah. All right. Where, where was that? Do, you, do we remember? Do uh, we have notes? Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I, I didn't realize you were waiting for me to like provide uh, this one right here. <laughs> uh, wait by craft room window, so it'd be the last. Oh yeah, letter, yeah, craft room. The last letter we got. Uh, it was the hmm. weird symbol code. That one. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Huh. All right. So we know that this already happened. So we're not like waiting for anything. Yep. But he still has a packing list in here. Is that his? I don't know where he's. I mean, or is that Meg's? I don't think anybody else is here. <laughs> you're 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 on him. you're on board with my theory. I think I am. You're on board with my yeah, theory. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> I feel All right. like did Sylvia right. like try to come rescue him, and now she's like playing. Somebody? Meg? I don't know. Some of this is weird. This list. What about it? Oh, left alone? Make bed. Request new ID badge. Piece of time assigned. Centered from the heart. From the heart. First to Waterton Lakes, then Teddy Roosevelt, then Payette Yellowstone. I feel like Payette may have been one of the cities in the documents that we saw online. Passport, left alone, food, or organized travel itinerary, allocate resources, green jacket, yellow backpack, sleeping mat, brush teeth, wine clock, set time, clean gears, wine clock, set time. Whoa, that's weirdly repeated. Um... That sounds like a Jasper thing to say. It does indeed, doesn't it? All of it. Uh, One clock set time, clean gears. Uh, where? I need to see if I can find our thing real quick. I need the list of places. I want to confirm whether or not I'm crazy. Oh yeah, sure. Sorry, everything's loading slowly because my internet's doing 20 million things at one time. Uh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Um, I used to have this ready, but I don't anymore because I'm the worst. Uh, we haven't really talked about it for like three months. <laughs> You're talking about the map thing, right? The the map thing you did. The map thing and yeah, yeah, the, yeah. Uh, we did that, uh, like the other, the other the spreadsheet that's attached to that uh yeah oh uh, like a spreadsheet of all that yeah i remember that uh actually that was four months ago. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think i i don't think i have them because they're not in this drive maybe you did it this way hold on one second yep this is it found it Ooh. Oh, yeah, look at that. Uh, and then there's one more. There's a map thing 
to... Where's the map thing? That was like in Google Maps. Like I think it just sent you a link to the to the collection or whatever. Yeah. Oh, here it is. Got it. Yep. All right, we got both these things. But let's look at this. So we're looking for Peyton. Uh, no, it was um, uh, Payette. Mm, nope. Nope. Mm. Dang, okay. dang, dang. Here's the fun map, too, by the way. Yay. All right. Um, that is kind of cool. Okay. So, yeah, that's interesting. All right, then we get into some more interesting items. Uh, these things, I think, are, yeah. are meant to demonstrate some stuff. Uh, the last one is just weird. Um, but first, we have a bloody ID badge. <clears throat> yeah, uh, it's it's a big fat ID badge, and it's got a significant amount of fake blood on the side of it. Uh, it looks like in kind and of a fingerprint kind of way, maybe. Eh, it's too ah, dropped it. It's too big to be like. Is it? I mean, it's oh like yeah, I see. Smudge, I see. Yeah, yeah. I see. Um. So this is for Clark Love, though, and I think he was on one of the memos, maybe from like yep. episode. Yep. Uh, it was the last one. No, it was the last one. Uh, we talked about Clark significantly in the last one because he was on vacation. Oh, he's the groundskeeper. Yeah, yeah. he was on vacation. He was back from vacation yep. on a Monday, and uh, blah 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 blah. Yeah. And so, it was his recommendation that Jasper stay out of the garden because of the lawnmower thing. Yep. Yeah. Yep. That's him. That's his whole thing. Yep. I'm pretty sure Clark's dead. I'm pretty sure the booty picture that was in the last box. Uh, that, would uh, this, of that would be dead this, this ass booty out picture. in the woods. Mm -hmm. yep. I'm pretty sure that ass is Clark's ass. He looks like a, a relatively thin dude, right? Yeah. Oh, there's this, like wicked glare. Sorry. This dead guy, though, has gray, gray, gray hair. If we look over here. Let me see. Uh, nah, man, that's a plastic bag. Oh, we discussed this last time. I did. This is not the first time we have. You have mm -hmm. corrected me on that, and I am sorry. <laughs> that is I all right. I am sorry. Yeah, somebody uh, smothered that dude, uh, and then looks like beat him up really bad. Yeah, there's like a lot of bruises. Well, I mean, uh, if I mean if he's been laying in the woods for a week, his body's gonna get a bunch of weird splotches and things on it anyway. Ugh, gross. Um. Yeah. Like super cool, but super gross. Yeah. So what happened to you, Clark? We have some ideas, and I think those ideas are demonstrated by these pictures of organs and things. Um. Yeah. So um, that's a little weird. So this. Essentially, they gave came... you like a human anatomy puzzle. Yeah. Yep. It's like all one card. It's like oh, a it's big. Card. Yeah. It's big. I did not expect it to be that big based on these photos. And then there's, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. It's like 11 inches tall. So they wanted you to do an autopsy on Clark, but I don't understand exactly what we're supposed to do. You know what we didn't read yet, though, that would probably be a key piece of information to all this? Jasper's letter. Oh, that's right. But also, I just want to say that with the um, cardstock anatomy dude, this was what was stuck to Clark's badge. Mm-hmm. Um, so there's like some, it's, it's like, just like tummy organs. It looks like. Yep. 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 Uh, are we so we'll see what the hell that's about later. Uh, you want to read Jasper? Yep. I'm ready. Cool. This letter is from Jasper to us as we are the listening friend. So what's going to be? Hello, dear friend. I've learned recently that the human body may sometimes develop a dysfunctional immune system. An immune system so misguided will recognize healthy parts of the anthropoid an, anthropoid, an, anthropoid body as integral to the function of the body as a whole organism, but is threatening to the overall survival of the anthropoid system. Doctors who study this kind of thing have yet to determine a discrete cause for this ironic deadly phenomenon. Fascinating. 
Still, I would very much like to know what they know, to get inside their heads and better understand such a complicated system. M maybe I could follow through where they fail to put things together. I am interested to know what kind of acronyms they use. Have, have you noticed how many acronyms doctors use? They are different devices, acronyms. They pull together separate pieces and describe the movements, discretion, process, or purpose of a thing while only using the first letters of its component parts. Sorry, sorry, sorry for going on about things. You might not even be able to comprehend. I get so caught up sometimes. <laughs> I get so not caught up. Not stupid, Jasper. God. <laughs> I get so caught up sometimes that I lose myself. I feel as though it has been ages since I wrote, last wrote to you. I have felt very much alone this past month. I have no friends here. I think I would like to be friends with Sheriff Randall, but he is very much aloof when he is here. Those stunning gray eyes, got gray eyes of his do not settle on anything or anyone. In fact, I believe the sheriff to be much too nosy about my surrogate home. His behavior is not what I would expect to be typical of a sheriff. He has provided to be much more interesting. I do not know what he see what what he sees when he sees this place. I would like to know. Perhaps he sees something different than I do. Not. Perhaps he sees something different that I do not. Perhaps what he sees is beautiful. And that is not the wonder and is that not the wonder of the world? Every human being sees just a little differently. We all have so much to learn from each other. I'm sure you have learned it from me. You may be surprised to know that I have learned a lot from this experience of ours. Relationships between bodies of work, just like any other system, including human bodies, component parts work together. Each part providing a unique function so that the system as a whole can serve as a collective purpose. What do you think our purpose is, friend? Can you see it? Is it not always clear until the component parts come together? Something we see it only when the pieces arrive in the correct order from the start. The wheels turn round and round. Every turn brings with it something into view that was hidden, like a dark side of the moon, but something those hidden things are demons gnawing at your eyes with their jagged, mashing teeth. It sometimes gets hard to see the light through all of that, between the grotesque sinew and the teeth. The thing that separates the day from the night is the ability to find the light. Shuttered in a windowless room. How would we ever feel anything other than darkness? Ever so cordially, Jasper. That's pretty grim. So there was nothing in here puzzly like he would normally throw in. Uh, the yeah. only thing he managed to talk about was the immune, was the immune system in the human body. Uh, and so that leads us back and to this bugger. Acronyms. Acronyms, yeah. man. Hmm. So... Oh, where do we start? one last item in this box that we didn't talk about. Oh, yeah. Random gear. Random Just gear. Little, Why is this gear in here? Little wooden... What is it? It's wooden? Mm-hmm. Hmm. What, what? Why? What is this? I don't, I don't know. All right. Fun for Jasper. I have no idea. Um. So some other interesting notes from this letter. Uh, I want to check one thing real quick. Yeah. So Jasper's letter is talking about the sheriff in real time, maybe. He mentions Sheriff Randall. He would like to be yeah. friends with Sheriff Randall. Uh. He's seen Sheriff Randall. Sheriff Randall has not seen him. Yeah. So who's Jasper playing? The doctor? <sighs> I, it Maybe depends. Clark at some point? Did you think Jasper killed the doctor? and now he, I think Jasper killed everybody in the facility, and now he's just playing all the people in the facility. All of them? Why not? I don't know. The timeline 
like fucks me up, honestly. Because... Something is clearly happening with Sylvia too. Yeah, that's a good point. Good point. Solid, yeah. solid, solid point. My, sorry, my contacts are driving me bonkers right now. That's fine. Um. Um. I think this is the first time I've like I've legit not known where to start with a box. Like, there's no obvious puzzles anywhere. It's literally just information. We have this thing here. Uh, and the online pieces of all this need to happen. Uh... We know there's an acronym somewhere in this damn box. I don't know where. But there has to be one. I don't have any ideas. I've I got nothing. It's, me either. I'm uh, I'm whoa. Wait, nope. Never mind. Um, uh, oh. So What's up? I when we were talking earlier about Felix's letter, um, at the end of it, he says, uh. To Seo Humani. Yeah. I had I had I had searched that. What did you find about that? Um, I found uh oh, shit. I speak nothing of the human. Okay. So uh, I I've I, I I had the Wiktionary up for Teseo. This is just like incidental that I've glanced over at this. Um it says like a general translation of Teseo is I am silent, say nothing, hold my tongue. Yeah. So. And then humani is human. So like, I I won't speak of the human, or I won't speak of him or the person or you know what I mean. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. No, I think it's. I think you're right. I think it's. So I think he's saying I'm holding my tongue, like I'm hold Felix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm holding tongue, yeah. Felix. Signing off. Interesting. Right. Sorry, just revisiting that because we thought it was weird. No, at first. it's fine. Um. <clears throat> hmm. Uh. Okay. So, what other? Like, the, I think the packing list maybe is the place to start because it seems like the most out of place nonsense. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, it does. Uh, like something is is the most obviously wrong with it. Centered from the heart. What the hell does that mean? Centered from the heart. Where do you see that? Right here. Sorry, I was on a different screen. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Why do some of these have a silly amount of colons? I don't know. Request new ID badge. Piece of time assigned. Centered from the heart. Makes me read things like they're very intense. Um, hold on one second. Okay. We need to pull up the listeningfriendsofamerica.org website. Ooh, good idea. <laughs> All right, now I'm looking at the archive list. Okay. Oh, there's another dot. What? I never saw the other dot before. <gasps> there's... 
something new. There's another dot down in the bottom left after you go into the archive. Oh, like another like little hidden linky do. Yeah. Is that new, or did I just miss that up until this point? Um, I'm actually going there right now. Hang on one second. Where is it now? Uh, down in the bottom left hand. After you go in, you go into the archive, and then you go into the archive. And then down in the bottom left corner of the archive is another archive. I don't think I see it. Throw this up. You uh, see this list? Yeah. Down here. Oh. Ooh. Is that new? I think that's or did new. I miss that before? I don't know, but let's click it. Go ahead. Archive, archive. Passwords are case sensitive. Well. What's that password? We don't know. Mm -mm. No idea whatsoever. Okay. Well. Interesting, though, yeah? Yeah. So I'm looking at this list compared to the archive list, and let's just find anything. We already did teeth, so brush teeth doesn't apply. Um, man. Man, man, man. I don't think we're going to have good luck guessing, and I think we should just look at something else. But that's really interesting. I didn't. I don't think that was there before. Yeah, no, I'm not trying to guess the password. I'm trying. I'm comparing this to-do list, this travel list, to the archive lists that we already right, know right, about. Right, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Um, no, you're good. Um, What do I do with these? What do I do with these organs? <laughs> Just got like organs with blood uh, on them. Honestly, you want my opinion about the organs? Like, uh, based on Jasper's letter, put them in order. I don't know what that means. Put them in the like in the thing. In the guy in order. He says everything has in an order and a guy. place. Yeah. Okay, so should I <laughs> cut out? Well, hold on. Let me yeah. let me grab some scissors so cut I can out cut the out organs. the little bloody pieces of organ bloody <laughs> pieces of organ maybe this is the substitute for not sending you real organs in the mail yeah maybe yeah thanks on a killer for not sending us real organs in the mail right i'd be significantly <laughs> upset <laughs> all right here we go little card um man cut through the blood Cut through the blood. <laughs> All right. Where's where's everything in bodies, guys? Oh, I man. have the small intestine, the, the large intestine, the stomach, and the liver. So your liver is, like, down low on a side, right? So, side? all right, all right, hold on. Let me get the guy up. Okay. Where's the guy? So I think it's going to go... Oh, excuse me. Liver, or no, stomach... Liver, small intestine, no, large intestine, small intestine, stomach, liver, large intestine, small intestine. Okay. It kind of layers in there, though. All right. And Gil goes up so under like the lungs. You see the man with the lungs like there? Here. Yeah. I do. But these are like clearly not to scale anyway. It doesn't really. I mean, look at the liver; it's gigantic compared to like. I mean, your the liver large is actually very large. Um, so I think the way this would go is the stomach goes um, on the bottom first, the liver kind of goes below and on top of the stomach, and then the small intestine lays on top of all of that, and the large intestine lays on top of all of that. It all just kind of wraps in a, like, in like a, okay, in like, like a, in like a torso bucket, right? So like up, like here, <laughs> here, here, so like here's my stomach, here's my liver, small intestine is in the middle, and the large intestine goes around. 
Does that okay, make sense? so what's yeah, but like what in the order of how let's do this in the order of how food gets through you. Stomach. Yeah. Stomach, liver. Small intestine, large intestine. Stomach, liver, large intestine, small intestine, yeah. Large and then small. Yeah. Are you sure about that? Maybe I'm wrong. I, I'm just making sure because what's first? There's large only four things. <laughs> what's first? Large or small <laughs> intestine? What is the order? Small then <laughs> large. Small oh, then okay. large. Fuck. Sorry. I had it backwards. But that, right. I, right. I had the I had the position in the body right. Shut up, world. <laughs> I don't think anybody's gonna be too mad at you. No, they're mad. I hear them. They're yelling. Okay, well. Um, okay. So then the Okay. So then that means if we're talking about acronyms. It would be S L S L or S L S I L I. Does that mean anything to you? No, hold on. Because it does I'm not mean anything to me. No, that's checking all right. something. All right. We're going to Google endocrine system layout. Endocrine system. Show me an endocrine diagram. Go. Oh, 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 no, no. This is way too specific. I want bigger, bigger, bigger picture, bigger picture. Okay, there we go. Nope, that's not it either. Wrong creature. Yes. Googling things. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna look at a. Um, okay, so the liver is not anatomy, necessarily connected, something. not necessarily connected in the chain of this thing, but it, oh. it 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 filters nutrients absorbed by the small intestine. Where does but, it sit, though? So it would it sits where 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 I pointed out it sits. Like it kind of sits on top of everything and in front. Like if you imagine the liver as like a big a big flappy thing, it kind of does mm -hmm. this and sits on top of and in front of everything about in this general space. It's big. Okay, so then in theory, liver would be in the front and the stomach would be kind of behind it. Yeah. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. And then the small with the, intestine. With the intestines down in the, like, where what people would consider their stomach area. Sure, sure. But it goes through the stomach and then the small intestine and then the large intestine. Correct. Okay, so liver, stomach, small, large. Yep. Okay, so with that, we have LS, and now it depends on if you want to include the second word of each thing, because it could be LS... S I L I or L S S L. Give me the okay. Well, give me the one with the eyes. L S S I L I. Google says anything. <laughs> I'm not clicking on the Hunter Killer spoiler links. <laughs> but we're clearly on the right path. <laughs> Why? I'm like I said, I'm not clicking on the Hunter Killer spoiler links, 
but we're clearly on the right path. Well, but like, why do you say that? Because it's mentioned. <laughs> this exact acronym is mentioned. I don't know what it means, though. Oh, like it's mentioned. Oh, 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 like Google. I see what you're. I'm like, where are you at? Okay. It'll make sense now. All right, well. Shit, I don't know. Put it in the password box. It's not a word. It's been a word before. Usually a word. Um, okay. Why not? Nothing. Is it a password maybe for one of the archives? Maybe. Do we know which archive we're looking at yet? All right, let's see. Oh, gosh. I'm knocking stuff over, guys. Things are happening. Archive list. It probably is, but what one? I don't know. Interruption, fifth, vouch safe cask, alteration woven object. What's a man you. <laughs> what? Uh, it's like the mm, seventh one down on the first side, uh, the first list on the left. I don't know what you're talking about. A manuensis. Oh. What was the thing? L. Oh, a man. Oh, oh, I know what you're talking about. No, I'm sorry. I was very confused. I was like, what are LS, you referring to? That's all right. S I L I. Um, yes, let's bring this up so everybody nope. can see what's That's happening. That's not it. Summer teeth tapestry, Dogon, shrine, bronze, Sally Hall, into it, social, horseman, everything, England, ancestor, epic, musings, oxygen, distempered, disease? Uh, L. S. Oh no, caps. L S S I L I. Nope. Mm. Tribe dance superficial call chestnut or nail. We'll come uh, exactly two thirty in the morning. Okay, it's not that. Going back to Jasper's letter. That's fine. I'm gonna try out some of these um, some of these archive links to see. Are you just randomly trying them? Yeah, cause I don't know, man. Why? Nope. L S. Oh, I'm really good at this. S I L I. <laughs> this is riveting programming too, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, no, it totally is. You have no idea. L I. No, God, why do I do that? L S S I L I. Well, it has to be something. Google says it is. Um, I'm trying to. Trying to see if someone gives us a hint at something here. We already did T3, yeah. Maybe there's another acronym involved? What do you mean? Maybe there's another acronym we gotta uncover. And the name of the doc and the, the acronym is the document. I don't know. Because, like, an acronym could be a plain spoken word, right? It would just be a short word. Well, technically, this is not an acronym. This is... I mean... An initialism. Sure. But, you know, 
That's pedantic shit right there. Sure. Um. Uh, all right, new plan. Okay, I'm, what's up? I'm gonna just start. I don't know. You did you start with the first document? I'm gonna start with the last document. I sure did. All right, I'm gonna start with the last document. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I just did Horseman, so I'm like... In the uh, horseman we already have. We know that one. Oh, that's right. I uh, got it. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Really? I did like 12. Come on. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I've been doing this shit for 10 minutes. <laughs> Which one was it? Nail. <laughs> I don't what? even know why. Why does that even make sense? Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, and with that, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to call it a day. Oh, good Lord. Fair. Emily. Yo. As always, somehow this turned out to be a great time. Somehow. Yep. Somehow. <laughs> Holy crap. Always fun. We'll do this again next week, guys. Uh, what else do we have going on this weekend? Tell us uh, all about it. On Sunday, tomorrow, we're playing Attack of Opportunity D&D. &D. Uh, mm -hmm. We're probably wrapping up the Curse and What are we going to do? Probably going to fight Strahd. We're wrapping up the Curse of Strahd storyline. Um, and then uh, on what, when, Wednesday? Wednesday, I think we're playing a video game. And then Thursday, Thursday we're doing the solution after dark. This show, another version using the empty faces boxes uh, on Thursdays. Guys. The spoopy ones. Um, mm -hmm. Come watch us do that too. We are just as riveting and terrible at that as we are at this. Um, yep. But yeah, with no further ado, we will let you go on with your evenings on the East Coast and middle of the afternoon on the West Coast, I think. Yeah, seems about right. Okay. We love you all. Bye. Bye, friends.